Hi, in this video we'll see about the map layers. As the name suggests map layers, if you want to give some other layers to your map like changing the background or changing some coastline, adding some different things on that maps, you can use the option named as map layers. So uh, before going through this video, I suggest you go through the other videos where I've shown you how to work on the different parts. Let us see now, how do we work on the map layers? I have created a map here based on this different options, state wise sales which I've selected. Now I want to customize this map. So for customization, I need to go to this map and I can select this option as map layers. So when I click on this map layers, I'll get a dialog box here on the left hand side where it says background, map layers and data layers, different options are given. So here if I say there's a style which is given, there's three styles which are given, light, normal and dark. By default, this one is selected as light. If I select the normal, this is the normal, uh, that is the style which is given. If I click on this drop down and if I select as dark, that is, that is the dark style which is given. So whichever you think is suitable, you can use that particular style itself. Now, sometimes if you want to highlight some cities, some areas, some states, some countries with some particular mark, you can use this option as map layers. So there are different types of map layers. The only thing I can show you in this place is coastline. So here there are some coastline at some places. If you want to highlight the coastline in your map layers, you can just click on this button here. If I click here, you just observe what is the difference you can find out on the maps. So I'll just click on this coastline checkbox and you might find a difference here. Wherever there's a coastline, those areas have been highlighted. If I uncheck that, if I uncheck that coastline and if you observe that has been removed away. So like this, there are different uh, checkboxes which are given for region, for states, streets and different options which are given depending upon the size or you can zoom out and then you can select the options. If the, if the zoom in is very less, you cannot select this option which is given here, that is the coastline. So remember that you can use it. Some more advanced features are given, that is the data layer. Based on the data layer, you can select the options. That means you can select the options as US occupations per capita income region wise. You can search for blue color occupation. Again, you can select as white color occupation. Based on that, you can keep on experimenting and finding out the different options. So I hope you have understood how to work with the uh, map layers. That is nothing but giving some design part at the background for the maps. That's all for this video.